Hello everybody, this is Howler of Howler's Domain, and we are on a game that I love playing. This is my all-time number one favorite game. No other game comes close to this one. This is literally my favorite. And we are going to be playing it. As soon as I type my freaking name in, we shall get in here. If nobody knows what this game is yet, it is on the old GameCube system. It is Paper Mario and the Thousand Year Door. I'm so excited for this. Oh, so much nostalgia! Mail call! Also, on characters that I know have actual voices, I'm not going to try to do voices for them, but characters that don't naturally have a voice, basically only Paper Mario characters, I'll try to do a voice for them. I'm new to doing voices. I suck at them, pretty much. Or I don't know how I'll do at doing them. I don't know. But y'all can read the text for most of them, like Luigi, Peach, and Mario, and all that. I'll try to take it a little bit slow, just in case if y'all need a little bit of time to read it. <laughs> that means you must come. Stupid. Stop that. I'm recording right now, computer. Paper Mario, the Thousand Year Door. What I think to be the greatest Paper Mario they have ever made. And yet, pers uh, my personal opinion, they went downhill after this one. Super Paper Mario, I give it about a 6 out of 10 just cause I was able to beat it so easily the puzzles weren't that hard and no turn battles so yeah battle system sucked no offense to anybody that loves the game if you love it then that's your personal opinion sticker star was alright the fact that you needed stickers to actually do an attack is what I hated but other than that the game was pretty dang good so I give it maybe a 8 out of 10, or 7 out of 10, I don't know. And then for the new Color Splash, I have not played that one, but I have seen one gameplay video of it. You have to have color to be able to color in a card to attack. What is with these stickers and cards? On here, you don't need that. You attack, and you do it. Just, that's it. There's no complicated bullcrap behind it. Oh, I forgot. I am also not going to be cussing on here. That was just a slip-up. I'm going to be doing a cussing on here. And it's going to be funny as soon as y'all hear exactly uh, what I would do instead of a cuss word. It's going to be funny. I'm going to do it for this entire series if y'all want me to. So, early on... First and sec first few episodes, leave a comment down below if you think it's funny. But the idea actually came from when I was at work and my co-workers needed to stay PG-13. So we couldn't curse around customers or anything like that. Yes, I would like to save. So we decided to come up with, uh, you know how they do the bleep sound? Okay, here we go. Uh, you know how they do the bleep sound whenever somebody curses in a video? Well, instead of that, I'm just going to say bleep! Or freaking bleep! Or what the bleep! Or something like that. Alright, now i got to do some voice acting for this guy. Here we go. Oh, come off it! 
You airhead, I know it's tough for you, but don't play dumb with me. I've seen you walking around town for information about the Crystal Stars. Well, now I'm doing the asking, so be a good girl and tell us what you know right now. I'm not going to do voice for her. So read that. Keep going. I suppose it wouldn't be right if a sassy little lass like you met an untimely demise. <laughs> Boys, we're taking this firebrand back, or firebrand to the, our fortress. As you command, Lord Crump, we're on it. Mario to the rescue! Bleep it! Wait, how in the world would I say that word? Bleep is? Damn it. I don't know how I would say that word. Uh. Uh huh? What do you think you're doing, chump? You think you can screw up my plans? Ah! It's always something. Looks like I'm gonna have to give you a little taste of the old crump a ball. Here we go, very first battle, and you all know what I mean when you see the battle. There's no freaking color involved, there's no stupid stickers involved. It's actual battling. Once they got rid of these turn battles, I just... Aw, oh, dang it. Oops. Buttons are a little bit weird on here. I uh, blocks su successfully though. Let me just do the hammer. It's a lot easier than timing the button. Boop. Two damage. Aha, block. Take this, Lord Crump. Would you care for a crumpet, Lord Crump? Yeah, yeah, we know. Oh, wait. Not everybody knows because they got rid of that system in the new games. Or wait, did they on... Ah, dang it. <laughs> okay, you got a couple decent shots in. I'll give you that. But, unfortunately for you, that means... It's go time! Punish him! Oh, crap. Oh, no. Mario. Oh, that's where Mario dies. See you, everybody. Okay, never mind. Quick, this way. God, that's a lot of them. Run. Run for your lives. Uh huh? Stop. Where'd they go? Huh? You, Johnson, did you see them? Did anyone? Ugh, crud. They bolted. Oh, it's hard to do that voice. Hurts my throat a little bit. But if you guys like it, comment down below and I will keep doing it. Oh, health the weed. Uh, here's where the boring text comes in. Y'all can read it. Okay, upcoming in the background, you'll see a little thing in the back happen, so get ready. I'll slow down the text even more just so y'all can see what happens. Alright, here we go. 
pay attention to the back. Stay down, bro. The boss sends his greetings. How's that road taste, punk? Are you alright? That hurt. Those jerks. We won't forget this. Okay. Continue on. If you guys do want me to actually read all the text, let me know, but, eh, I think it's a learning experience for y'all. <laughs> Plus, I just don't want to freaking read all of it. I try to read too fast, and I end up, I end up slipping up a little bit on it. I'm not used to reading out loud that much. I just read in my head. So, you'll be in the inn. Alright. Huff, I say. Huff, I say. <laughs> uh, to Toad's Worth's always funny. Yep, that's the same princess. Yep. Eh, maybe. This episode's turning out to be quite boring, but y'all are getting some story in this. And this is just explaining how she works. I already know how she works, unless y'all want to hear this. You can give hints, blah blah blah. Also quite helpful in battle. Head bonk. Tattle ability to see weaknesses and HP. Okay, we got the gist of it. Can we go now? Find my professor. Oh god, it's a Goomba version of Egad. I forgot about that. <laughs> Alright, so we gotta go find him. Let me save real quick again. There we go. Da da da. Wait, wait I remember something. Hold up. Alright, go in here. Yes, I know how to buy stuff. Shut up! Shut up! Take a fire flower. Yes, I got an item. Blah, blah. Let's go. I'll take one of these mushrooms. Um, shoot, I'll take another fire flower. There we go. Alright, let's go. Onward! Let's see. Dang it. I keep remembering that dang... I just remember that dang chest is out of reach for a while. Ugh. What the? Hey! You mother bleeper! Son of a bleep! Get back here, you bleeping! Damn! Uh, let's see. Hey, you gotta think about it on how to bleep. <laughs> Um, 
Get back here, you son of a bleep! Or I'll bleep you up! I actually remember where he is, so that's actually very helpful to me, because I get my money back. Give me my money! Douche. I think Nintendo could have put up like a few different wanted posters because I see one that's a Koopa and I think that's for 4,000 or 4 million? I don't know. I can't tell. I know it's a Koopa. Dang it, Mario. Keep going. My controller's wonky. I need to see if I can find a better one. Alright, this is what I'm wanting to do for this episode. Hello there. Whoa, whoa, hold up. Now, you're an outsider. Past this point is the turf of Ishnail, head of the Robos. It's ten coins to pass through. You try to pass without paying, and I'm afraid I'll have to wipe you. To have to whip you, but good. Okay. Uh, I can take you. What? You gotta be kidding. You think you can fight your way through here? I'm gonna make you eat your words, tough guy. Let's get this party started. Oh yeah. Alright, switch. And tattle. See what he's got. Yup. That's Gus. He's super annoying and tries to take tolls from everybody. Max HP is 20, attack is 3, and defense is 0. All in all, he's pretty tough. And I've told you a million times that pointy spear of his hurts if you stomp on it. I wonder if this guy watches people pass three, 365 days a year. Talk about a workaholic. <laughs> true, true. Die, Gus! Yeah! Ah, dang it. Come on. Fire flower. Go. Alright, so another hammer. Dang it. Why is my control not working now? Crap. Hold up. Okay, here we go. I didn't hit the A button enough. I kept tapping it. Yeah. All right. Eh. Block. No, not mushroom. Fire flower. Yeah. Since she can't head bonk, I'm using her with the items. I remembered this. Also, plus I went through the recording freaking two other times. Aha! Block. Ain't got no more items, so you defend. There we go. And hammer. Yeah. Haha, -ha, Gus. You will not defeat me yet. Or you're not gonna defeat me. You didn't the other two times, and you're not gonna to going to this time. Especially since you're attacking her the entire time, and not me even once. So yeah, this works out perfect for me. Yeah. The recording's still going good. Oh, dang, I forgot that could happen. Parts of the stage can fall on you. <laughs> oh, I love that, though. Wimpy shot. And I win. Yay! 22 star points. Haha. -ha. Crud! You dumb video game heroes always pull this stuff. It's ridiculous! You think violence solves everything, don't you, huh? Don't you? Yes, I do, at this point. <laughs> okay. I'm going to end the episode here. I'm going to go save. And heal poor little... Uh, what's her name again? I keep forgetting. Goombella. I'm going to heal poor little Goombella at the end. And we'll save. But I will see you all next on the next episode. So please like, comment down below what you thought of this episode, subscribe to join the pack. <sighs> subscribe to join the pack. 
And as always, everybody, have a howling good time. Oh!